let's have a circle. A circle place of a circle. Higher of a circle. And the radius of a circle. The definition of pi is the ratio of the circumference of a circle to its diameter is equal to circumference of a circle over 2r because the diameter of a circle is equal to 2r. If you multiply both sides by 2r, you get 2πr is equal to circumference of a circle. Or if you keep to the side, you get circumference of a circle is equal to 2πr. Now, if you divide the circle into pies, like, I like, like, so, and if you rearrange the pieces of the circle and write it out like so, you have something that looks like a rectangle. Then, if you slice the circle into infinite number of pipes, then you will have something close, very close to a rectangle. And as you remember, the area of a rectangle is obtained by multiplying the length of the rectangle by the width of the rectangle. In this case, the length of the rectangle is the radius of a circle. And the width of the rectangle is given by the half of the circumference of the circle because our half of the circumference of a circle is goes on top of the rectangle and the other half of the circumference of a circle goes down to the bottom of the rectangle. So since we have circumference of a circle is equal to 2 pi r, if we divide by this by 2, we get pi r. So the area of a circle becomes pi r squared. So and let's take a look at the cylinder. Cylinder, once again, we find out that the circumference of a circle is equal to the pi r. And the height of a circle, let's see, um, yeah, it's a height. So, so if we want to find out the surface area of this cylinder, we have to find out the area of circle multiplied to because we have two circles and we have to add the area of our side of this cylinder. So how do we do that? So area of a cylinder is equal to uh, pi. The area of a circle is equal to pi. And the surface area of a side of the cylinder is equal to The circumference of a circle is by the height of the circle. So if you add these two areas, we will get the surface area of the cylinder. So let's find out. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
1 square plus 1 r Now, let's find out the volume of the cylinder. Volume of the cylinder is quickly find out. Let's look at uh, Let's see if it is correct. But here we are. We have a R. Here we are. The problem of a cylinder is equal to the compass of a circle. Area times no area so this five r square times eight. Let's see if this from area of the code. Okay. 